When you're dealing with circle graphs, you also often need to find out how many each section is. So we know the total is 48. That means the entire circle. We know the straight line here tells us that it is half. So this whole thing is going to be exactly half. So this is one half or 50%. So we can use percent of the total. So your percent is 50% of is times 48. Now some of you can figure out 50% of 48 is just taking half. Some of you will type in des into your Desmos and get 0 0.5 for your percent times 48 and your answer is going to be 24. So now we know that this over here is equal to 24. To do the next one, if we were going to have this, if we had a line that came straight down here, we could see that this is a 90 degree angle, so it's a fourth. And it's cut, that's 1 eighth and that's 1 eighth. So we're going to turn this fraction of the total. Fraction is 1 eighth of is times our total is 48. So when we're multiplying fractions, we turn it into, each of them have to be in the fraction form, so we turn it into an improper fraction. 1 times 48 is 48. 8 times 1 is 8. Now we can divide. 48 divided by 8 is 6. So now over here, there is 6 in this section. Now the easy thing to remember, this half is 24, which means the opposite half is 24. So if we want to know how much goes in this section here, we can subtract the total 24 minus the 6 that we're given, and it tells us 18. So this is 18. So we have 18 here, 6 here, and 24 that equal 48.